Hey there everyone, this is Alcal playing uh, VIP2, the redo, and last time we started World 7 after finishing World 6. And it's kind of silly because we did one level and it only basically leads to one other level. It's kind of a linear place, it's really unfortunate. Ghost Coaster! Which I believe is another Carol original, like they're kind of stacked in the back because you can only put technology in the back half of the game. Even when the level maybe may not warrant that level of difficulty. So we got Cackle, a scary Skeller man. And uh, yeah, this is a recreation of a beloved Donkey Kong Country 2 level. You can't get the time because your score, star score, gets deleted forever and gets replaced by this little gimmicky addition instead. There was a passage right down there and I missed the plus. Oh no, I will not be a battery anymore. Gotta dodge the negative because it will make you feel bad and so you will not be able to see clearly. This is set up in such a way where now as soon as you do, you won't be getting green no more. You gotta dodge all the red and I'm doing a fantastic job at it. Oh no, he played finger tag with me, by which I mean he tagged his finger firmly in between my vertebrae. And I have known nothing but the pure essence of pain for a few seconds. I don't even know if this level has a secret exit. <laughs> it's, just, it's just kind of there. It says, hello, my friend, how do you do? Hello, my friend, uh, I don't like you. Gotta s stop and wait, see if anyone... Or I don't think this level has a secret exit. Of course, this being a ghost house, it's hard to tell, but I'm gonna go with my feeling for now and follow the linear path in World 7 to right down, left, up, left house. Right down, left, up, left... R-D-L-U-L. Ardlul. It's uh, right down, left, up, left house. Better take some notes, I guess. Oh, I think I remember this. Yeah, it's kind of silly. You go right, then up, then down, then left, then up, and zero, and then you become an airplane. And you forget everything you thought you knew about Cocker Spaniel, which turns out wasn't all that much. So ultimately, it's not that big of a loss. Hooray! No, hurry! Hurry! Different words, <laughs> they mean different things. They share most letters. See here, you gotta hurry up because the ceiling's all like, yo, do you like how my gentle, like, whoa, colonnade moves here? Well, they're there to indicate some kind of danger, see, so don't be a dummy and get punctured, see, because uh, punctured is not a good trait to be. Unless you're some kind of mollusk or something, and then suddenly there's a whole lot of eeries and ghosts. Eeries and ghosts. Ghosts are more scary than they are eerie, unless they are like some kind of manifestation of something that feels familiar, but is not. I guess that's how I would define it, I don't know. Here is the part where we go like, oh no, blue blocks, what am I gonna do, I don't know. This is the part where we gotta zig your zag. Everyone likes to zig a zag. If you never zigged, well, you know, zig your way through the heart of infamy and all that. That's what I always say. And then here, you know, the zigzag zig continues, but it's a lot shallower. You gotta watch out for sea and you might step on something prickly and destroy your shoe and or your entire navigation system. See, I mean, I wasn't all that far off from being all smushed by blocks! Farming a ceiling tightly knit together at last. This is the part where there's water. There's also a scary ghost. It has bad breath and also no change in his pocket. That's why he's scary. Because if he ever encounters problems on the road, well, maybe he won't be able to make it through. And I mean, there is there anything less scary than an avant-garde lack of safety? I don't know if such a thing can be considered avant-garde, but I suppose you can if you're being real original about it. Had to wait a little bit to jump between two precise ghosts, because otherwise I wouldn't be able to live with myself. This is the part where you gotta go the ladder and there's ghosts floating around. Oh no! Ghost floating around! Although, in terms of an elevator level, this is kind of an original arrangement. You've got these, like, electrical pole-like pole sort of structures to navigate. It's actually kind of cool. Like, kind of. You know, at least if you're not... If you're not too picky about what you consider cool no more. And this is kind of neat. Kind, kind of. Uh, again, I need to emphasize 
That's like not full blown all. Like you know, it's not ta. Oh, I made a mistake. <laughs> I thought I'd be safe. I just think that that might be kind of the problem with this part in, in and of itself is that basically once you learn where you're safe, there's not a whole lot to this little place other than just kind of like taking the time that it takes. It takes a non-zero, fairly always the same amount of time to go through. So you just need to learn where to step when. And for the most part, you're gonna be mostly alright. Hey, look at that, I got... It's still there though, it's kinda weird. Oh no, the ghost is locked up there, what will we do? Well, we will force reality to go up, and so everyone's up here with you! Yay! For some amount of yay, well, I mean, I'm, I'm pretty sure he's happy. I'm not, but it's not just my happiness that's important. Ghosts are allowed to be happy, because otherwise you're gonna mess up your pots and pans and become birds. That's just not something you want to see happen to anything out there. Being a bird, more like being a bird. I think like one secret exit, you go in this pipe, and the other exit, you continue up. It's really original. I got one up. I got on the door. It's pretty great. I'm outside. It's like, whoa, look at that. There's a cabana. I wasn't there before, and now a life appeared. My life has changed forever. For some definition of ever. Like, I mean, for most microscopic organisms, a few minutes is literally forever. It is as long as their conception of time will ever last. So, uh, Larry, calm down. I've got a secret exit to go and get and go and get go. Oh, wow. <laughs> it's kind of funny because, like, the vips have trained me to kind of seriously expect the worst out of ghost houses in terms of insane, crazy, weird exits that don't make sense. Like, a e i Oh, no! Yesterday's video. But some of them are just pure platforming levels like this, also that death was terrible. What am I doing? Wow, no, yeah, this is mind-numbing, wow. Makes you do really weird things. Because it's not an extreme version of it, it doesn't make it any better. So, I, yeah, this is no. Probably you're probably better off going in the other direction. Difference now, now though, is that I know this guy's gonna come over here. Yeah, it's just it's like it looks fancier because now there's big blocks of blocks, but like it's. It's a continuation of the rest of this place and that that's what it is. It's just learn where you want to be at. Be at where you want to be at. <laughs> if, if you look well, if you're observant, you'll be able to suss it out just through observation. Because, I mean, ah, there we go. That leads to the same place as prior, but this time... I have a P-switch. What does this mean? Means you can make a bridge and fall an arrow to the end of the world. Hey, Spike. <laughs> this looks really awkward and weird and neat. Gotta go in the door. Yo! Oh, 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 before it's too late. Oh no, a ghost! Uh, so yeah, now we fight. <laughs> a ghost on a freight elevator. <laughs> <laughs> this is so neat. It's just, it's just that then you gotta go, ugh, you, uh, you gotta work your way back down. But then you gotta ride an elevator again. Riding elevators is cool and fun. It's like, alright, yo, butt. 
face zone. I hope I don't get hurt again, but it's kind of hard to predict, because I don't know if, like, I guess the ghosts save where they are, huh? Because uh, I'm gonna admit I was just kind of writing it out, so not being the most careful might be less dangerous. So just kind of do this manually here. Whoa, or not! Hey, ghost, how's it going? I'm shaking, I'm vibrating with victory! The course is clear, now set sail for a new horizon! Across the block! Ice cream sandwiches may or may not be on the menu! Look at that, there's level all the way up here! That's crazy town! This level isn't as linear as it looked like, it's not just a straight line! There's a yellow sphere right there! Who would have imagined? Next time we go down the only fork in the level world. Strained smile.